In today's video, I'm going to show you how to clean one of those radiators. Show sure, these style. How to, well, not the outside, but the inside of them. How to get all of the dust out, or at least 99%, with um, quite an easy and simple method. Sure, I've discovered a couple of years ago. This one is compared to Baxton fairly clean. The reason is because I've cleaned it. Because I've cleaned this one about two years ago, and before that, the air was always nasty when I used it. And also, yeah, also a big problem when you've got allergies, especially pollen. Because you even can feel these symptoms in the winter. So, what's the solution? Pretty easy. Compressed air or, or in this case, shop vacuum. Let's turn it yeah, to return and just basically blow it through. So, also, what's pretty nice about it, it's not only pretty easy and stuff, but also pretty quickly. Also, a little disclaimer and a little advice. Before you do that, the best is open your windows or if you're sensitive to dust or um, dust allergy or so, put on a mask. Also, do it, the best way is to do it um, before you uh, do dust cleaning in the house and like a day before vacuum cleaning. That's the best. So all the dust which is in there, gets blown out until it settles and stuff yeah it's a little bit messy but come on what what else would you do take off the whole radiator <laughs> let it let it completely bleed out and wash it through with a garden hose over in the garden like, come on that's ridiculous i wouldn't do that <laughs> too much work anyways time to start oh yeah right <laughs> i'm gonna make the uh, brand Anyways, time to start. It's a little bit hard to see, but let's see if I make it a bit clearer. But yeah, so far I can say, but yeah, about 99% of all the dust land and all the other stuff got out. Yeah, that here is a little bit got a bit wet. Yeah. Can get that out with some wet cleaning. The important thing is that all the fins of the radiator are clean on the inside and yeah also huge dust storm here from that thing so better open up the window and let it air out anyways that's pretty much it for this video don't forget to like share and subscribe and i'll see you all next time on random fixes and restorations with another helpful video about cleaning or, or fixing something or restoring something. Anyways, see you all next time.